Hey there gamers and welcome back to Sea of Stars. In the last episode we finally got the items we need from the Necromancer in order to bring Garl back. And boy did we. And a whole bunch of insanity ensued after that. Mainly, the main big thing, the face-off with the Dweller of Woe. And it was an intense battle. It was actually pretty sick. You gotta check it out. We'll have that linked specifically down in the description below. So if you want to skip right to it, skip right to it by all means because it was an awesome battle. The rest of it was pretty, pretty cool too. Lots of lore building, lots of story coming through in this episode. I hope you enjoy as much as I did. If you'd like to see us live, check out twitch.tv slash beard on fire. There's a link in the description down there for that too. Subscribe if you haven't already. And as always, hit that like button if you liked it and don't like it if you don't, but let's just jump right on into the game.
was muted this whole time. Wow. I've been streaming for a while. <laughs> How are you doing? Oh, thank you for saying something. That's embarrassing. Funny, too. Hooray! There we go. Wow. Okay. But we don't need this anymore. But we do need this. Crazy. All right, now we're set. We're ready to go fight the big bad. I'm just trying to get like, you know, every little secret uncovered here. Okay, all the crystals are glowing now. With Shimmering Sword, I think I paid money for one of those already. No, I didn't. Nice. Another sword that does 10% damage to undead. A Solstice Sash. Where is this? Well, that's a new place. Magic attack plus seven. That's, that's good. We'll do Solstice Stash there. Hmm. You can't have two power belts, right? Right. Okay, I'm going to call it good there. I just realized Sarai took off with all of our good stuff. And we had so much gear. And it's all gone. Okay, I'm not sure what those crystals did, but... We touched them all. You no know, fall damage. That's good stuff. Good master slash anybody else in chat. Do y'all play Stardew Valley or have you played Stardew Valley in the past? Because I saw they just came out with another update and I haven't played in years. So I thought it might be cool to catch up on some Stardew. Fantastic game. I've played like so many individual sessions of it, but I've never made it past like year one and a half. So I'd love to do a playthrough where I actually like play the game for real. And streaming is like, the perfect excuse. I could get it, but I haven't played it ever. Oh, dude, it's solid game. Really solid game. I mean, if you like, there's like some pretty simplistic dungeon delving where you do, you know, some fighting. It's all pixel based, just like this. Uh, the music, the soundtrack is so good. It's so good. The cleansing won't be easy. Better make sure you're well equipped. Is it true that you were able to defeat Ramaya? Oh, wait. We want to talk to the pirate captain. Cliche. Doesn't have anything they want to say. That's fine. So. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed in like two, three years, we just have a ton of Greek, like really good games coming out. Well then, let us head out. Stay close to me, everyone. Oh, Garl, you're about to get shut down, my dude. 
Oh, girl. Oh, this is, this is gonna be brutal. Onwards to the cleansing. Hmm? Shh. There it is. Surely you weren't thinking of coming with us. Hey, I can fight and I'm a good support. That's true. Dwellers are impervious to all but solstice magic. Your mere presence would be a liability. Well, the Elder Mist gave me special permission. What? I'll know when to step aside, don't worry. Make sure you don't get in the way. This guy. Troll Hunter, what's up? Did you did you notice? It was a new sound. We have we have some new stuff going on. A couple of new things here and there. Okay, I gotta show you guys a couple things, because so that's how I spent my day yesterday. <laughs> Adult moment straight up. All right, back to the game. Anyway, then he said he never used any spells on regular monsters, only to use nothing but the most expensive one when he fought a boss. I'm confused as to how any of this could be considered fun. Well, to each their own, I guess. Going somewhere, Captain? Captain doesn't answer to anybody. Anybody. Oh, good. I'm glad we didn't have to go through the entire woods again. If it's always dark here, how will we know when the eclipse happens? Oh, you'll know. The curse of the night shroud is strong, but it won't withstand the eclipse. Can't wait to see that. Any moment now. Alir? Time has come. Dolstice warriors channel through me. Does Erlina have like a robot arm or is that just her dress? That was awesome. I love Garl so much. Quickly now, our window is short. So the dweller lives in a house. Into the haunted mansion. Erlina and Brugavis, you will clear the basement. Do be careful. The glutton is a fearsome foe. The glutton. Ooh. The fog machine is going to overheat. Yeah, it's going at a thousand percent. This is about to be an on fire house. Call the department. We'll see about that. Blair and Zale, you will cleanse the ballroom and make your way to the gardens. The botanical horror will pose a challenge, but you have what it takes. We won't fail. We're about to get into a little shop of horrors coming up next. Remember what you learned, lunar magic against the soul-based ones and solar magic for those more concrete. I am heading upstairs to start working on the final seal. Join me when you are done and we will rid the world of the dweller of woe once and for all. Godspeed, solstice warriors. Did someone say horror? <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> Yeah, Little Shop of Horrors. Have you guys seen that with the uh, the plant 
that eats people. This book is full of boring old records from past tenants. I might find that interesting. Lena and Brugavis are in charge of the basement. Let's find the ballroom and gardens. Okay, cool. I saw a chest up here, so let's get that first. Oh, fine. Oh. Oh. Yeah, enter the secret passage. Duh. I know we have a quote-unquote job to do. Wow, that was a pure accident that I touched that candelabra. Did anyone else not know how to pronounce that word for the longest time? There you are! I can't fight the Dweller with you, but I'll do what I can otherwise. Hey, you must be Sarai. I'm Garl. Thanks for the help earlier. We're glad to have you back. Don't mention it. Sarai's such a badass. <gasps> okay, so we still only get three. Interesting. Increases bonuses from timing hits and blocks by 10%. Increases damage dealt to undead by 15% and increases damage dealt to undead. So 25% bonus to undead damage right here. That's pretty sick. We got spectral cape. Cool. All right, let's get that pirate garb. Otherwise, we're still looking pretty good. Wow, I was today years old when I realized that you can use some of these uh, skills outside of combat. Okay. Oh, it shows the combos too? I've got to get some combos for old Sarai here. How could she just teleport in? You know, sometimes you just uh, don't ask questions. Just some dusty old books. I think we should probably light more fires. Just seems to be going pretty well for us. I think they are going to reveal that, though, because they already talked about it in one bit of conversation. Didn't see that coming. Did not see that coming. Okay. So Garl's going to do a straight-up attack on this guy. Bubble drop. I don't know if we can block those, but I can try. There we go. Okay, that was sudden. All right, what are these guys called? Spellbook. Straight up spellbooks. Cool. Well, let's Soul Sister I can get some MP back. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Cam on the opposite side of the screen. Yeah. Well, it turns out I was covering up all the stuff over here. Yeah. Yeah, we had a whole issue where, like, I didn't even notice for hours and hours. But don't worry. Smoke Bomb now works over here, all right? So, you know, you know like 
things. The stream works is what I'm trying to say. Oh, you can swap in and out mid-battle. Is that... Yo! You can swap out mid-battle and it doesn't even take a movement. That is huge. Yeah. Dude, that's a whole... <laughs> oh, we have a whole new mechanic to work with. This is sick. Uh, hey. Thank you for getting rid of those evil spirits. Here, you can use this fire if you need to rest. Oh, nice. There are other lost souls in this mansion who can help you, but they won't come out while the evil spirits are around. Uh, that's cool. How are we doing on food? Whoa, oh, we are low. Holy shit. Hello. Yeah, smoke bomb is fixed. Yes. Indeed. Hello. Hello. Yeah, yeah, we could use a couple of these. But for real, guys, how is Wednesday going for you? It's going good. Ooh, we should make sure we make some mushroom soup. Just kidding. Not enough milk. That's all right. Something I've realized about this game is that you don't want to ask about the origins of most of the ingredients. Like the eggs? Those ain't chicken eggs. Busy, huh? That's kind of a turn of events for you, isn't it? Isn't work normally kind of chill? All right, that's enough cooking. We'll save it too. Why not? By the way, how was Helldivers last night? Okay, all right, all right. Hey, I'll fart on you. All right, cool. So we just have a couple of standard attacks. Oh, wait. Rain straight up told us that we should do moon powers on these guys. So let's swap out for you. Good amount of bonus damage. <clears throat> Holy shit, that hits hard. Sun's out, hobo's out. Oh, true, 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 true. Heck and intense. Silencer and I were getting our butts handed to us on the silver platter. <laughs> Press X to deflect. Biggest damage I've done to the game so far. Yep, Squidmaster, Nate the dog. You'll get used to his sense of humor eventually. Over generations, the evil presence has fully engulfed these rooms and halls. Are you here to help? Then perhaps you should take a look at the torch left of the fireplace. Perhaps so. Cool. Well, this was a place at some point with, you know, with real people and events in it. Glad you're here, Squidmaster. <laughs> you know, the obvious thing? You didn't, you didn't hit the obvious thing? 
The little juice boxes are for lunch only. Set of guidelines for those who used to work as servants in the mansion. Okay. Yeah, no tricking me this time. All right, six. So... This one's easy. All right, we can hit everybody with this attack. Da -da 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 -da. Hit it. Boom. Nice. All right, so we reduced a lot of those locks. We've got a combo after that. How did you miss that? I don't know. I really don't know. I was probably just chit-chatting. Thought he already tried that. Nope. No. No. It's, it's too obvious for me to try it. All right, we're going to phase shift this homie. I don't think I've had a successful block this whole game. Right, Troll Hunter, see you in a minute. <laughs> Biggest heal we've got. He hits so hard. <gasps> Conch. Food? Ooh. Milk. Is it weird that I trust the ghost milk more than I trust the milk that I get from, like, forest yaks? Recipe for Moon Cradle Fish Pie. Nice. That fish pie is actually fantastic. It does MP and a decent amount of HP for the entire party. Hello there. You look strange. Are you alive or something? Hey, Fran. We're looking for the ballroom. Do you know where it is? Oh, yes. It's somewhere beyond this door. I'll tell you what. You make me a sandwich and I'll open the door for you. Deal. How do you like yours? My favorite is pretty simple. Two parts... Hepar, four parts dust, three parts sugar, and one part rust. Between two slices of dread, of course. Uh, okay. Where can we find these ingredients? Oh, the kitchen has it all. Let me get the door for you. The recipe's on the counter if you need it. And please hurry, I'm starving. You're ghost starving. Awesome. Cool. So we got a little uh, secret passage via painting right there. I'll get this going. Do you mind gathering the ingredients? Yeah, no problem. Two hapar, four dust, three sugar, one rust. Two, four, three, one. Three sugar. I think it was four dust. Two hapar, four dust, three sugar, one rust. Four. 
the bar. Two. Rust is one. And dread? Yep, get it. Snack time. We should have deliberately made the wrong sandwich just to see what happens. Next time. And done. We should go see that ghost now. Got the master ghost sandwich. Ooh. Did you make my sandwich? <laughs> Let's eat. Oh, that is one good sandwich. Here's a little extra for your trouble. Thank you. And it says to open the secret passage to the kitchen, just look at the pot in the garden. No, it's it's uh it's hard to get a lot of these these locks. I almost messed up that very the second one. That would have been sad. Ooh, not my best work. I forget how hard those hit. Those hit so stinking hard. Um, let's do one of these. Sick. All right, we got combos. We got combos coming up. Oof. I think priority is block damage. <clears throat> but yeah, let's just dash strike all of these guys. There it is. Oh, if you haven't seen this ability, it's awesome. Jam. Hey, question pack number three. Okay, so earlier today, we found a secret entrance to go talk to the quiz master. I effed up the first quiz with some like basic answers. Feels bad, man. Um, next time around, though, quiz pack number two, we're getting this. Got a crown. This is a pretty good shot. I like it. Is this the ballroom, you think? Get 
Didn't mean to do that. Honestly, did not mean to do that. There we go. Time to crown the king. Oof. Chat, stop distracting me. Oh, Valir's down. Oh, Valir's down. Okay, let's swap. That wasn't the best idea. Okay, let's do this phase shiv. This one. Ooh, can we do it? One attack? No. No. I bet we crown this statue right here. Or that. I miss Lucent. Okay, so what do we got? We've got another statue. Oh yeah, this makes more sense. Okay, so knight's helmet goes on the knight, crown goes on the king, bada bing, bada boom, skull time. That's a lot of skulls. Oh, ad break. Sorry guys, I wasn't paying attention. Okay, so we switch those by tapping them. Here we've got bird, ant, human, cow. Bird, ant, human, cow. And then cow, human, ant, bird. Whoops. Oh, you can do two at a time. Cow, human. Ant, bird. <laughs> Let's get the shiny. Zale and Sry learn the combo skill X Strike. Heck yeah. Okay. Skill Zale. Combos X Strike. Sword, Sun, and Venom damage that hits all enemies. For two. Okay. Okay, that's huge. This is a cool environment. Hmm. Kind of like this shot. Did I just do F12 for screenshots of thumbnails? I probably should. Here we go. Because then my face isn't in it. Is it F12 or just print screen?
Spectral cape. Got bone armor there and mage knight armor. Place hasn't been cleaned in a while. It makes sense to me. Spooky. Oh, we are not in a good place. Uh. <laughs> Yep, Sarai's down. Ooh. Gotta love a hearty stew. started. It's got a cool little, like, ceremonial stone or something like that above there. Cer ceremonial stone. No dancing allowed in the ballroom. may not be vulnerable, but I bet this still does a decent amount of damage. Yeah. It said for passage to the garden, there would be some kind of pot that I touch, something like that. That was a medium heal. That was pretty sick. Okay, is there any obvious lever that I should be pressing right now? Thank you for clearing the evil spirits. It sure feels warmer now. Oh. Are you going to the gardens to fight the botanical horror? We sure are. Oh, okay, so yeah, there's something that we touch in here that gives us a passage to the kitchens and probably our conch. The cult of conch grows stronger every day. Not looking at the ghost, 
Oh, they said the pot in the gardens to go back. All right, nice, nice, nice. Why are there, was there 18? Were there 18 ads? Real question, because that's insane. Basically, like, I'm given a choice with ads on the channel. I could just not run ads, but then anytime somebody new comes to the channel, they get ads, no matter what. And I think Twitch still runs ads every now and again because they're Twitch. Or I can run them on a schedule for, like, once an hour. But it's supposed to be three minutes, not 18 ads. That's insane. Bah. Okay. Well. How can I talk to you? You are behind me. See? That's the kind of egg that I'm really suspicious about. What's up, guys? No? Don't want to talk to me? That's fine. That's fine. This one. Conch count. Twenty one. Our conches are legal drinking age in the United States. Eight eggs. All right, I mean, even if they're ant eggs, that's like it's a lot of eggs. Might be worth it. I'll have to research the ad thing. I think, um, what's the streamer's name? Pirate Software. We had some kind of like YouTube short that I saw when I wasn't streaming. I talked about ads and like the how he does it. No, he's, he's a guy who thinks about this kind of thing pretty deeply. So maybe, just maybe, he's got a little something we could do. So, boost first, then combo. There it is. Not a bad heal. Honestly, not a bad heal. Wait, disorient. Badass Lady Gamer, what is up? We're killing it over here. Dude, we need a Sarai and Valir combo so that we can do some blunt and poison damage. That would be pretty sick.
right, this will do it though. A little something. Boosted and attacked. You chillin'? Oh shit. It's not good. Timing is so off today. That's cool. Chill day, all about it. All about the chill days. What have you guys been playing lately? Chat? What's been what's been on your gaming list? I was talking earlier about how the uh, Stardew came out with the new update, and I'm interested in playing that. And of course, Steam has like a billion sales going on right now that are tempting me. Erect. Helldivers 2. Oh, yeah. Uh, I think so. Yeah. I think the new update just released. I think that's what Steam said. Yes. We're making three of these. So good. I guess I'll have to make a new farm today. <laughs> there you go. Let's just let's just double check it. Let's just double check, just to be sure. Steam Shage. Yep, Stardew Valley 1.6 update available now. Some of the changes, a new major festival, two new mini festivals, a new environmental event, hundreds of new lines of dialogue, a new end game skill system, new crops, crafting items, furniture, and more, a new farm type, Meadowlands, multiple pets, way more. It says, I don't want to spoil everything. That's not me. I'll spoil the shit out of you guys. Ah, just kidding. I don't like spoilers. But yeah, sounds good. Right? That's like a lot of content. That's a lot of content for a game that's been out like with no in-game purchases, microtransactions for, for freaking ever. I'm stoked. Squid Master been playing Dredge. Didn't you 100% Dredge already? Guess you're gonna have to stream Stardew. I guess so. I mean, you gotta, don't gotta twist my arm about it. Oh, Troll Hunter, we played... Uh... We played Troll Hunter, or we played Troll Hunter. We play. <laughs> we played Dredge on stream a while back. Hot dupes, what up? You did 100%. Just can't get enough. Oh, we didn't actually rest. Let's do that. Hey, oh, no one plays me. You're damn right. Botanical horror. Feed me, Seymour. Balls. All right. So what do we got? We've got ooh, five different targets. Look at that crap. All right. So three turns for most of these guys. Yeah, thinking Moonerang's a good idea. Yeah, we can break the hell out of the right-hand side, and we can do most of the left-hand side. Or some of the left-hand side, anyway. That is the longest Moonerang. Venom Flurry. Focus up. Uh, 
Probably my favorite attack so far. Dredge is the only reason you found my channel. 100%. Yeah. I liked it who's playing Dredge on Twitch and found that with zero viewers, that was me. Dude, that was when, like, I had kind of started streaming back in December and then took a break because I was trying to run another business at the same time and uh, then decided to come back to it and was like, well, I may as well pick off, pick up Dredge where I left off. And there you were. All right, so we could do... I think Dash Strike gets us the most bang for our buck. Let's do it. Nice. All right, and the main enemy is open for freaking business. Let's, uh... Let's combo X Strike since it's new. That was sick. That's when I was like, oh, I want to watch him stream, but spoilers. Yep. I keep playing story based games. I want to stay with you, but the one stream I liked was the one stream you disappeared for a month. I know, right? Oh yeah, you were there in December. Yeah, you were there for that first uh, stream in December. Yeah, that was like the day after Christmas. And then yeah, literally the next time you were back and I was like, holy shit, you remembered. Uh, yep, yep. Maybe we do, we just take advantage of this like moment and do a moon cradle fish pie. Kind of a waste of the health, but totally worth the MP. Did we save the Moonerang? Nah, we use it. We use it right now. Honestly, mistake made should have uh, disoriented with Sarai instead. Squid's a real one. I mean, they're actually a real squid. Yeah. You didn't know? Now we hit everybody. Here it is. The worst. I am a real squid. What do you mean? <laughs> Just make it sure. Alright, so those two are still up. turns. You're going to get a turn. Let's very jam yourself. Jam yourself! And we're just going to hit with everything we got. Hmm. 
Yeah, let's get one more turn out of this guy. Dude, that was a way to do it. horror. I think I'm scared of that. I think I'm scared of botanical horror. Let's regroup with the others. Oh, dude. I love the lighting. Lighting the darkest places. The Dweller is yours. Good luck. All right, bye then. Nothing. Nothing. Wait, Badass Lady Gamer, does that mean you plan on playing this game? If you're trying not to get spoilers, or is that mainly Outer Wilds? Oh, that was Dredge. Dredge word. We were having dinner right here when it happened. I'd steer clear of the maze if I were you. The botanical horror devours all. About that. Maybe enjoy the maze in your afterlife. That's not a shortcut. Only. Hey. Any ideas, guys? Air feels very cold. We've got fire. What's up? Wasn't paying attention, just decoration. Oh. I hope you know what you're doing. I don't. But you know what? I'm going to do it anyway. This side of the wall feels brittle. Let's see if we can break through. That did it. Should be a useful shortcut. Yeah, all right. I meant to actually say something. Okay, okay. But we'll see. If we get some ability to create warmth or heat or something like that, we'll go back and give that a try. Let me guess. They're not back yet. Oh, they are. Couple of badasses. Good work taking down the botanical horror. The dweller of, dweller of woe is beyond this barrier. Join me now. <laughs> My dear Garl, your courage has been humbling, but you absolutely have to sit this one out. <laughs> no worries, Headmaster. I'll just watch. That's funny. You absolutely must. position. I'm going to take on this whole together as a group. Take turns. The rune I prepared will force the Dweller of Woe to materialize. I will have to maintain focus for it to be vulnerable. I trust you to keep me alive and take down this spawn of evil. You can do it. Dude. Garl, if you're going to do anything, you should just heal up Moraine, man. It comes. Brace yourselves and do not be fooled by its appearance. It is immensely powerful. 
Because Carl's gonna save the day. Okay. I am fooled by its appearance because it looks weak sauce. Oh, okay. So we're going D and D wizard, huh? Yeah, hold it. How much damage Zale does? Holy balls. We're smoking this thing. Uh, should we take down the mirror images? Yeah. Disgusting move. Yeah, let's get that little bonus in there. Holy shit. Okay, this is way too easy right now. Absolutely way too easy. Garl is going to get murdered. Badass, enjoy your lurk. Yeah, let's uh, focus here. Yeah, we've got a combo up. the opportunity get a little bit of extra MPs look at how much health Moraine has it's nuts Hmm. I don't think I have anything that does two sun damage. Five hundred fifty two was an insane amount of damage. All right, so we're going to do that, and then we're just going to do a normal attack so that we can do another like uh, protective freaking bubble thing coming up. shield. Oof. 
Kavis is a badass. Yep. Hundred twelve. This is pointless. It won't even show its true form. So much for that rune. Hmm. Preparations were done properly. We just need more direct light from the eclipse. Look at him gritting his teeth. Garl, get up onto the roof and find a way to let more light in. Now! Dude, Garl. Okay, I'm on it. All right, I won't let them down. There's got to be a ladder here somewhere. What do you know? Oh, dude, I can't open a menu or anything. So far, so good. Now to find a breach or something. Too solid. Got to keep looking. Looking for more flashing white. There we go. This isn't it. Come on, girl. Your friends need you. There we go. Flashing white. Flashing white. All right. There's an opening behind the debris. Time to smash through. Let's see now. It's all clogged up with rubble. Ah, too heavy for me. Use a lever. Lever. Think like search and rescue, dude. Can't give up now. Think, girl. Think. Girl, the way to save the day. Straight up. Oh, that thing Yolanda told me about gunpowder. Maybe if I just... Bet this will do just right. <laughs> you filled a cooking pot with gunpowder. You go, girl. Aha! It worked! That's bound to come in handy later, too. Cooker surprise. Okay. Everybody inside just, like, shrapneled up. What the? He could have warned us before pulling something like that. He did it! Perfect. The Dweller is showing its true form. Let us finish this. Oh. That's nasty, man. You nasty. Yep, let's get that down to 67. Gotta get the lunar shield up. I really want to keep Valir's MP up just so that we can keep the shields going if we've got to. Oh, this is going to hurt. Yep, 
These moves are awesome. Focus on Lunar Rune to... Yep, 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 yep. Think about this. I could do four hits with Moon Moonerang or whatever. Getting the two sun strikes is tough. That's the tough part. But maybe the other guys will account for something, maybe. Let's see what we can do. attacks like get a boost. Do nothing? What was that? Doesn't make any sense, man. Holy shit. Hold the rune. That was bad. Hold it. We can't waste turns healing. First things first. Let's get that lunar shield back up. Damn. the turn to put the lunar rune up. Is 
Is that their combo? I think that's their combo attack. Dude, it's awesome that they're doing combo attacks. Like, just the, uh, the AI is just getting after it. problem no problem chat no problem maybe a little problem there for a hot second but after that no problem quick obliterate the core what the f oh. i won't let you sarai Drop your weapon right now. Tell them what... Lena, explain yourself at once. Use the crystal now, Brugavis. I'd rather make this quick. Brugavis, don't! We tried reasoning with you. You left us no other option. Do it. You really did hold up your end of the bargain after all. Go back from where you came, fiends. These minds are not yours to twist. Oh, is the old man tense? Tense and confused, too. What do you want? Why, the very same thing as your two former friends here. For those born during a solstice to live free. Are they not forced to train? Train and fight horrors too? Lias, you worship the Fleshmancer. Without Solstice Warriors, the world would be doomed. Hmm. This meets our conditions. Alina, why? We took the deal. All they asked for was to conjure a blood moon. And then there would be no more of this nonsense. Yeah, the hell is happening indeed. The betrayal is happening. No! My, you catch quick. Catch on quick. At long last, the Dweller of Strife will be resurrected. Resurrected and made stronger, too. Rugavis, how are you okay with this? Have you ever wondered what it would feel like for your life to be your own? But why? We just defeated the last Dweller. You can't truly know that. And don't you see that absolutely none of this endless conflict is your fault? It doesn't mean it's not our responsibility. Or yours, by the way. It's not too late, Burgavis. Destroy the core. I'm sorry, Valir. We made our decision. Why give up now? Some of us could still ascend. Into guardian gods? Don't make me laugh. How many centuries were spent suffering and wait for this fake promise? That's a good question. Where is Garl? Don't you think it would have happened by now? Enough talk. We must complete the ritual before the eclipse subsides. No, you can't. Oh, I believe we can. Three still hasn't talked. Can and will, too. 
The time has come to resurrect the Dweller of Strife. Now give us the Blood Moon. Well, that's the thumbnail. The three's still just standing there. Like, no motion. Oh, brisk. So Sarai knew what was up, too. Sarai tried to... What? Oh, my God. I mean, more monsters to fight? That's... That's kind of what we do. We're safe for now. I'm sure the three of you can take on whatever that Dweller of Strife is. You don't understand. The Dweller of Strife took everything from us. More than two dozen Solstice Warriors, and yet... Mm. But the Elder Mist said... How could they... Headmaster. Let's hurry back. All right, Squidmaster. Catch you next time. See ya. He doesn't seem badly hurt. Probably just a lot to take in. Nothing soup won't fix. Oh, it's a stone. I thought... <laughs> So I was just sharpening the sword on her leg. Not the twins. Easy, headmaster. You need to rest. Thank you, young lad. You have been quite caring. Don't mention it. Blair, Zale. Yes, Headmaster. I need more time to recover. Our enemies, our enemies must be at the Fleshmancer's old castle on Mesa Island by now. Mesa Island is currently unreachable, but I trust a solution will come to me if I meditate. In the meantime, please go check on Brisk. Assess the damage and do your best to help any survivors in need. Right away. Thank you, young ones. I will catch up with you when I am ready. I'll go immediately. See you in Brisk. Care to take us through the port? Okay. Reminds me, I need rest too. I gotta go to the empty office tomorrow. Gotta love that hybrid work schedule. Gotta love it. All right. We'll catch you later, Troll Hunter. It's good hanging. Oh, this is us. We're, we're gaming again. We're gaming again, everyone. so quiet here. How are we doing? Yeah, we are full. So it was all true? You really did it? Looks like the Night Shroud is staying, but to be rid of the Banshee, no more fear. Do a little save save. Something huge fell down from the sky and crashed into Brisk. I hope everyone's all right. Wraith Island is free. Thank you. Thank you so much. Wasn't there one more of you? Oh, 
You defeated the Dweller of Woe? Yeah, nice story. <laughs> Captain just left. Ain't been acting like herself since we arrived here. Well, y'all went and did your thing. Congratulations. <laughs> Aren't you proud? Y'all saved a lot of people, pals. We... a lot has happened, and we're still catching up. Why the long face? Did something unpredictable occur? <laughs> Y'all look like your mentor turned out to be the bad guy all along or something. Fucking Deadpool here. See ya! Oh, was that the one? Look, well-meaning is my middle name. I'm sorry, I didn't know it was this bad. I. It's okay, Yolanda. Just had a lot to take in right now. Well, anything I can do to help, you let me know, right? There is something. Lay it on me. Risk was hit pretty hard. Our orders are to get back and assess the damage, see how we can help. Consider it done, son. Y'all ready to set sail then? Assuming you're all done here, of course. I don't think there's anything left for us to do here, so yes. Pause it right here. No. Gotta be so bad. Squirming. Squirming, I tell you. With the resurrection of the Dweller of Strife announcing a reign of terror, thought forever gone, hope appears as slim for a world with only three solstice warriors left. The veil of lies now lifted and part of their innocence left behind, our heroes head back to Brisk while their headmaster searches for a way to reach Mesa Island. Committed to helping the Cataclysm survivors, they will soon dive head first into the eye of the storm to confront a legendary ancient curse. Kind of a big deal. Port Town of Brisk. Not doing so hot. Three hundred seventy five health. Wow, okay. That is a lot. We only have one combo point.
How much did our attack go up? Like, this is insane. These are way stronger than what we fought in the mansion. The Dweller of Strife really must be formidable. And no eclipse anytime soon. There's got to be a way. Let's clear what we can. The Dweller must have crashed somewhere. We have to find it. Okay. Please don't eat me. Please don't eat me. Please don't eat me. Hey, you're safe now. Find your land at the docks. Your group will keep you safe. Solstice warriors. They want to be praised. Please help the others. Okay, so we can rescue... Rescue the normies. Cataclysm. We will protect these villagers. My name is not Kenathan. Don't you worry about us. We can fend for ourselves. Hey, pal. Any other villager you find, just send them right to us. We lost almost everything in the Cataclysm, but if there is anything you need to buy for the journey, we'll use the money to rebuild. Sure, a couple of hearty stews. Don't mind if I do. Thanks again for saving me. Okay, you remember how huge this uh, this town was? This town is gigantic. All right. I meant to go in the menu and look at these guys' uh, like attack power. Thank you. I was certain I was going to die here today. Can you get to the docks on your own? People are gathering there while we take care of the monsters. Uh, yes, I can make it. Thank you. I wish I had more to offer. Tomato club. I'll take it. Sandwich payment done. Attack? Yeah, attack bumped up significantly, up to 52. I think it was in the 40s. Maybe not that much. Anything to grab? No. Take me go back down and just make sure we didn't miss anything before moving on. Okay, that was it. Music is pretty good, huh? Oh, no. Oh, yeah, we got to get in there and save that person.
Wait, what? You don't let me jump down in there? There we go. I almost got crushed when everything grumbled. Thank you so much for getting me out here. It's not much, but I hope it can help. Dude, all these food payments. Thank you, lady. Okay, chat, let's keep an eye out for any more out of the way villagers we can discover. out of there, friend. Uh, okay, fall in the hole, then blast that box out of the way. Physical attacks do like nothing against these guys. They're super weak against everything else that we do. Eight hundred sixty four XP. Ooh, if I could farm here. Oof, that was close. I should head for the docks. Thank you so much. Here. Do we have any basic salad should be nice. Okay. Dre would be good. Cool. Oh, the Sleeping Serpent. Sleeping Serpent have, like, is that going to come into play here? Ooh, three of them. Huge XP. How is there nothing to do down here? That doesn't make sense. Okay. 
well. All those innocent people. How big is this thing? Hey, you're Solstice Warriors, aren't you? I mean, some of us. We've cleared out the monsters. It's over for now. The big one flew away. It might come back. Why? <laughs> Don't worry about it. My friends here are stronger than the big monster. Really? Totally. Wah! It's safe here for now. Please gather at the docks with the others. We're not giving up on you. We'll figure this out, I promise. Thank you. I hope my brother is okay. Your poor brother. We can't stay here. Where are we going to go? We need to do f find new lives for ourselves. I was born here and I will die here, just like my ancestors. We can rebuild. I'd rather move somewhere new. Somebody get a hold of that kid. Okay, hold tight while we figure this out. Now what should we do here? Clearly some of them need to move on, but... There's too many of them for Lucent. Plus, that town already has its own healing to worry about. Yolanda, are there any other places you can think of? I reckon a fresh start be just what some of them need. Kainathan? How about the small island to the northeast? Oh, the unclaimed one that's filled with... <laughs> oh, the unclaimed one that's filled with pine trees? That could work. Precisely. We know the way. But the Oakham skiff won't get us there. Gotta hit the open sea for that, so we'll need a proper ship. Okay, that's a good lead. Good news, everyone. We know the f uh, perfect place for those who wish to leave Brisk and start anew. Yay. Does anyone have a ship we can borrow? Listen, bud, practicality is my middle name, but this beer port is totaled. At least but one option, it would seem. Oh, I like where this is going, pal. Well, then speak up, tall guy. Reclaim the Vespertine! That's a negative, matey. Ain't no pulling that trigger without the captain's say-so. Can you go do a quick outfit change? Kenathan is right. The time has come. Ahoy, captain. We thought you gone. Will this ship be good enough to carry settlers to the island Yolanda mentioned? Look alive, son. The Vespertine could even sail the Sea of... Yolanda. Apologies, Captain. I'll take us there, guaranteed. Okay, so what's the plan? The boat is cursed, isn't it? In fact, that's the easy part. All we gotta do is get on board, meet the owner, and let the Captain buy the ship using the coin of Undeath Accord y'all fetched earlier. A sound plan without even breaking a sweat <clears throat> we'll see about that for now we hike to the peninsula and wait as dusk falls the vespertine will appear but for a brief moment the window is short so we must jump aboard without hesitation all in a day's work captain so pumped for this the three of you are not coming with us. Captain? 
If we don't make it back, you must find another way to help the villagers find their new land. No way! We've been prepping for this forever. Our end goal remains the same, but for this step, I need you to stay safe. Can you do that for me? I will do as the captain commands, or my name is not Keenathan. Aye, aye, Captain. Can we at least see you safely to the peninsula? Of course. Let me know when you are ready. Still can't believe what happened. It was so sudden. I'm staying. We will rebuild and make Brisk even better than it used to be. Uh, no, I'm good on Wraith Island. Solstice Warriors, I wanted to thank you again for saving me earlier. Truly heroic what you did out there. Here, take this as a reward for what we've done. Basic armor. I mean, that's money. I lost everything. I can't stay here anymore. Okay, we should cruise through and just make sure there's nothing to grab. It truly is exciting to be nearing the payoff from all our attempts to get the Coin of Undeath Accord. It will be a transaction for the ages. Oh yeah. We lost almost everything in the Cataclysm, but there's, but if there's anything you need to buy for the journey, we we'll use the money to rebuild. Yep, 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 yep. Um, yep. Are right, we good? We good? We have no home anymore. Oh, what to do? That was too scary. Why don't you cry about it some more, kid? At least we have our work cut out for us. Risk is not all lost. We just need to work together. All gone in an instant. But Brisk is strong. We will rebuild. Oh, okay. Well... Shut it down then, huh? Peninsula. And then he went, Behold the pain of everlasting sin, and turned into some half-something form with a beautiful face blowing softly on an apple with feathered wings. What happened next? Choked about 26 of the elixirs we had been saving for later, and eventually we won. Huzzah! A valiant battle! Did my pen just die all of a sudden? There we go. Get ready. We jump on the next flash. Orders, Captain? Keep the villagers safe until our return. Can do. Will do. Safe journeys, Captain! Are right, you going to reveal your identity to us? With everything happening, it seems there will never be time to explain, so...
Please don't tell my crew. That's <clears throat> right, we sort of knew already. <laughs> what? Then why didn't you say anything? You're clearly on our side, that's all that matters. Yeah, whatever your reasons are, they must be good. Oh, and thanks for spending the coin to save me. Hi. We agreed to let you keep your secret, but it's good to see you trust us now. I'm sorry, I should have... It's okay, we're a team now. So you understand claiming the Vespertine won't be as easy as we thought. Yep. And it just so happens we owe you one, so all the better. Thank you. Now. Will they just swim? Dope-ass battle music. You fools! The Vesper team will return to the Sea of Nightmare any second! Get off right now! Uh, nope. That's a no from us. Uh, we like nightmares. Hmm. What happened? I saw someone in there. Welcome to the Sea of Nightmare. Nice going, binding your souls to an ancient pirate curse like that. Hello, we plan on claiming the ship for ourselves. <laughs> now that's a good one. How do y'all plan on doing that? These two are solstice warriors. Pardon? They can use solstice magic. No creature is immune to it. Solstice magic, huh? How could such a coincidence? You're another hallucination, ain't ya? Brace! See, if maybe we can do like a higher, like a higher pirate voice. Do I have to do a low pirate voice all the time? No, I don't. What's that gonna look like? All right, Stormcaller has sensed your presence. And I suppose that makes you real. So you're the one known as the Navigator. Portents be the name. Use it. Can't imagine how y'all ended up here. But it's a relief someone can finally fight those things. You mean the ghost pirates? Aren't they... My former crewmates? Aye. Going along with mutiny will do that. Will do you in like a little else. Well, I suppose instigating mutiny is worse. Sometimes I wish I was also made an undead of the brainless sort. So your former captain, the Stormcaller, how can we stop him? If the last couple centuries have taught me anything, it's that we can't. See, the curse has only two possible outcomes. Either Stormcaller gives up, or I let the Vespertine sink. And by the looks of it, neither is happening anytime soon. What if we fought him? Look alive, Stormcaller be the most formidable wind mage the world has ever known. We can hold our own in battle. Oh, reckon you can beat a grudge so strong it magic to parallel nightmare realm in which a torture to torture crew for an all eternity? Look, if y'all are foolish enough to wag your swords at him, I won't stop ya. But first his wind barrier needs weakening. Where do we begin? There are three lightning rods sending power back to the maelstrom where he channels the everlasting storm. Y'all want to confront him? That's the first step. Where are the rods? Even if I knew, ain't no way to tell which way is up in this nightmare. Okay, how about this for a first test? My map should be below the decks in the kitchen past the crew quarters. If y'all can fetch it and return alive, I'll entertain this plan of yours. One map coming up. Okay, don't hit that. That thankfully did no damage. 
I mean, Crow's Nest is the obvious, clear first choice of where to go, right? Guns for hands. Oh, that's fantastic. Cooker surprise. Area damage. Yeah, let's do it just to see what's up. Vulnerable. Those guys are vulnerable. Sick. Such a weird sound effect these guys have. These two are all about physical damage. Do a dash strike then. Or is it blunt damage specifically? Might just be blunt damage. Anything else I can do up here? A hearty stew for a hearty crew. Looks like a logbook. Maybe useful? Maybe no? Maybe no? Maybe yes? Good cradle fish pie. Only a couple centuries old. Oh goodness. All the way back we go. scramble right there. Low decks we go. Oh, 
Oh, it's the bird on his hat that's making the squeaky noise, or the squawky noise. That's awesome. Probably just outright kill you with the phase shift. So let's do that. Flip. Locked. That was a pretty tough attack. Yeah, a little physical defense seems good. Magic attack seems really good too, so that puts the 42 magic attack. Forty-nine defense. We get to forty-seven magic defense. Kinda round it out a little bit. Keep the mana going. Okay. Hit the physical. Hit the physical attack. Same with you. We got a pretty balanced party. I'm not sure if that's the right call. Okay, let's swap for Garl. Garl can do a hurl and at least get something done here. Let's hit the Venom hard. That was the worst. That was the absolute worst. I'm not gonna lie, that's actually a pretty tough one to block right there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh.
like two really fast blocks right in a row. Strips of Kong, what up? Keep rocking up now, dude. <laughs> I barely miss you, dude. Sorry about that. Or maybe I missed you a long time ago. I don't know, but good seeing you. Good luck with your, uh, with your trip, dude. more of this. How about we rest and then save again? Physical damage for these guys. Let's forty one solid. Seems like we got so much more powerful after doing that last boss battle. It's crazy. No combos. That'll have to do it. Yes, I get we we get a boon. Oh, can we grab that? Well, that's lame. Bone got glitched. I feel like we should be able to blow the uh, dynamics around with our fart fist. On the map. Let's return to Hortons. Not before taking rest and a save.
Hello, Hortense. Hey, y'all are starting to give me hope. So how can we find the rods? The magic map connects to the sea. Should allow you to get an idea, idea of the place. Okay, we got this. Why don't you take the wheel? I could certainly use a break. All right, see a sail. Three islands, one rod each. Once they're out, we can storm Maelstrom Point and take the fight to the storm color. While sailing, hold square to move forward and left and right to steer the ship. A map can be opened by pressing the big button. It shows your current location as well as your objectives. Okay, well, easy first choice. Oh, I'm loving this. Woo! Do I just run into it? Ah, X. I see. Sea of Nightmare. Oh, nice. Oh, we already rested. Okay, gamers. That's it for me for today. Thanks for being here. Uh, if you want to join us in chat, you can check out twitch.tv slash beard on fire. There's also a link in the description below. We will be playing this live for the next coming weeks. So as you see these episodes coming up in the playlist, like feel free to dive right in. We usually play starting at about 10 a.m. Pacific time uh, for about, you know, two, three hours, sometimes four. Occasionally we'll film like two episodes in one day. So, you know, if you think you're in the window, come check it out and give us a follow. And then you'll see when we go live. So, you know, you can watch whenever you want. Let's see. Anything else I want to say to you? Oh, you should subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, give us a like. Thumbs up. Thumbs down if you don't. That's fine, too. Catch you next time. Bye.